Women's History Month and Bowling Green State University is one of only a handful of schools with women in certain key leadership roles within the football program. 13 Action News reporter Lisa Guyton spending time with them at spring practice today. She's back from BGSU live with a story all new at 530 tonight. Lisa. Uh, Lee and Christian, according to BGSU, it is one of only three when it comes to the highest level of NCAA football schools with women heading up both the sports medicine and operations departments. And there are plenty of other women with critical roles within the BG football program. We bring a different perspective. We have a little bit different mindset with some things. We can see things a little differently. When you look around spring football practice for the Bowling Green Falcons, there are plenty of women at work, and that is by design. We've got a lot of great women in this program. BG head coach Scott Leffler says Damaris Linker is one of them. Every facet of our program uh, she's a part of. She gets to uh, make sure that, uh, that I follow directions. <laughs> Not always easy, but uh, she's uh, really good at what she does. Damaris is the director of football operations for the team. I do everything except on-field coaching and go out on the road recruiting. So I do all of our team travel, organize all of our team meals, um, really am the liaison to every department that touches our program, so that's academics, marketing, game day operations, compliance. Danny Coppice is the team's head athletic trainer, a job held by a growing number of women in college football programs. Things are evolving in a good way because women are involved, and I think it's kind of made our care a little more well-rounded. It's not just about the nuts and bolts of timelines, of return to play, of the, the injury. You know, a lot of it is, well, how is he doing mentally? Where's his head at? You know, how is he feeling? Coach Leffler says there's huge value in having a number of different voices at the table. And Danny's voice is a powerful one. Being able to walk into a staff room and say, hey, listen, I don't care what you think. He's hurt. He's out. And... Uh, She's the voice. Whatever she says goes. It's very fun to watch uh, Danny and Damaris on a daily basis. The women say it's been a level playing field at BG, and they're grateful for the opportunities. The two are focused on reaching back and inspiring the next generation. Take chances, ask questions, volunteer, get involved. Um, you're never going to know if you like something until you try it. You're showing them that it is possible, no matter who you are, where you come from, that if you work hard, you put the time in, and you know, you're good and you know your stuff, that those doors can open for you too. What an important message. Now, there are four other women with significant roles in the BGSU football program. And in case you're curious, according to BGSU, Kansas State and New Mexico State are the other two high-level football programs with women leading both the sports medicine and operations departments. Lee and Christian. Well, great story, that was huh? A great story. And the whole time you're telling me, yeah, we do that better. Well, we you do know, that there's better. There's some things we women just do really well. <laughs> I'm, I'm on board. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> well, still to come, Netflix, Hulu, and Disney Plus. Many of you are spending more money.